Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm gonna talk a little Shania Twain, and only one degree of separation is sitting right next to me. But practically, her career was halted when she found out her husband was cheating on her with another woman. Now, she's turning tragedy into reality on a reality TV show. And my guest is a local therapist, and she joined Shania for the show, but not as her therapist. Anita Vaccaro, Anita Vaccaro is in studio to tell us why why about her role on Why Not with Shania Twain? That's the name of it. That's the title. Why not? Yes. Okay. Yes. Anita, thanks yes. for joining us. You're welcome. I, you're welcome. What is going on? There's like twists and turns in the show, and yes. you're a part. You're a big part of that. Yes. But you are a therapist. Right. Okay. Yes. So what's your role in the show? Yes. And that's I came on to not only talk about. Um, the therapy side of it and what a therapist thinks and how they deal with certain things but actually as the person because as I said in the show I would rather help than try to hide the past okay you know and what was the past the past was I was the other woman I when I was 20 years ago 18 uh -huh. years ago I was the woman who was the cheater I was the one who did things behind my friends back uh -huh. and so my feeling was her her question was why and why not my answer was what for okay and so I was trying to help her to kind of process her pain by telling her different scenarios of what that woman is thinking of you know not only my own but as a therapist seeing other people and and being able to speak also as to what they might be thinking in the show it came across pretty much as just me yeah so when I got on it, you know, I got an email basically from the producers right. that said they got an email from Shania saying, you know, forget everybody else. We want Anita because she can speak from all these perspectives. We can right. help people and it's going to be fabulous. Plus, it's just going to make for contentious drama. Right, right, exactly. Hey, hold on. Let me just let me uh, just break from this topic mm -hmm. for one second. Yeah. Okay. She's pretty hot, huh? <laughs> She's pretty hot. She, she's hot. You know, I would bet she thinks the same of you. Really? I would bet. Oh, I, I kind of feel like you're, you're, there's just something you want to say. Oh. Well, like, you know, really, she probably, the way it was coming across to me was yeah. that she kind of wished she met you before she met her husband. Oh, I knew yeah. it, Monica. I knew it. I knew it. I, I, I shouldn't to thank spill you. those beans. You're thank welcome. You. You're All welcome. right, so getting back to, the, getting back to this uh, show. Yes. Yeah. So how did she take it? She, she literally... She she did not have kind things all the all the time for you. No, she didn't. When you know, I think her intentions were there. I really do. Yeah. And um, but when I sat down in front of her, mm -hmm. I became the other woman. Yeah. And I think she was really struggling between trying to be appreciative and dealing with her own emotions. And and here's the to me as a therapist, the most significant part was this. Yeah. Shania Twain is who she is because of her strong personality. She's had major tra tragedy and a trauma lot. in mm -hmm. her life, right? right? She's had to deal with and become this great success. And so in it, her way of coping with that, as you've seen, it's no secret on the right. show, her way of coping with the trauma that she dealt with was with her head yeah you know yeah and now and everybody gets stuck in their lives when their coping mechanisms don't work anymore sure and when they start asking themselves you know what she didn't she's just found herself catapulted into a situation where she could really only she couldn't disconnect her heart anymore yeah she had to come to terms with her heart and her feelings and with me on the show, you know, she could not not work with right. me. Right. It, it, it turned out to be good, and you don't and you don't regret being on the show. You love being oh, on the no, show. Oh no, no. And no. I could talk to you all day about mm -hmm. this because mm -hmm. it's my favorite topic. But right. um, you know, we do we do have to go. But just one last question. Yes. She's pretty hot, huh? <laughs> She's pretty hot. You know, I'll tell you if uh, if I right. was if I was you know if I if you were um, her I, if I was her I would be you know all over we, it. We wouldn't be we wouldn't be in front of the right. viewers anymore. Exactly. Thanks. <laughs> that was fun. Monica, you know, I had to yeah. I had to go there a little bit. Yeah, Doc, thanks. <laughs> now I gotta work with him for the rest of the day. Okay, no, thank you. <laughs>